Hey guys, welcome back. So I figured I would go ahead and do a video on this because it's literally every time I wear lashes, I get, oh my God, are your lashes real? You know, I just get really so many questions about my lashes and they're fake. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, I have my husband's dog in here and she just barked. Feel better? Obviously I have this one in here too. Whatever. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with my lashes. I always use Ardell Wispies Black. Here. Oh, I'm not judging my nails. They're already out of the package because I've worn them already. But I'm gonna show you what I do when I reuse them. I actually don't, I just pull the glue off. Yes. But, so I just pull the glue off completely to where I have like another, a, a clean base again for it. Kind of just jumped into this. I wasn't like, oh, let's just keep watching. But, all right. So do you see the difference? This one has glue on it, this one doesn't. You so say you can see that white band again. Ooh, my nails are rough. Okay, so I'm just going to zoom you in a little bit more to really show you that I have absolutely nothing on my eyes. I'm going to do everything on camera. I zoom in, but I'm surely just going to get closer. All right. Everything's rough. I don't know if you can see it. But. Okay. All right. So I'm just going to go in and see I have absolutely nothing on my eyes here completely. So I'm going to go in, I am going to do just a very light liner because I don't want, I kind of want it to look very smooth and seamless and like my lashes. But I don't always do this, but since I'm going to work, they're going to be on for a while. So what I do is I get my liner. I'm going to focus like this. And I just completely... Like I get it as thin as possible and I drag it across and all over my fingers. Now it doesn't have to be a perfect line because it's going like I'm going to go back over it once I get my lashes on. You'll see. Oh, it's close. We'll see. All right. So now that I have that done, I'm going to go in and put mascara on my lashes. So I'm going to curl it real quick. I hate when it does that. It pulls the liner off. So I'm going in with the Maybelline New York Sensational Lash. I make sure I get to the root of my lash. I don't just put it on the lashes actually get to the root to keep to get my waterline and near my lash as black as possible. Now that I'm done one coat, I'll go back in and do another coat on my bottom lashes because it's just easier for me to like match it that way. Because if I put my lashes on and then try to match it, then it transfers mascara to my top, and I don't want that. <clears throat> I'm going to let that lash, I mean the lash, I'm going to let the mascara like draw off a little bit. If not, it's so hard to use in the, I use tweezers, not use tweezers, <laughs> but you can if you want to. I use tweezers and it's like it can get stuck together when I go to pinch it and it just it messes it up and it makes me very frustrated. So the lashes that I get, like I said, are the Ardell Wispies, or I'll get double Wispies, just depending on like my mood. But if I get more like, if I get House of Lashes, or um, oh, if I get any kind of dramatic lash, I can't think of the names right now. But if I get any kind of dramatic lashes, then I have to cut them or do a thicker liner. Just it really just depends on the lash and the look. 
how it has to happen. But with Ardell's, I've never had to really cut them unless they, um, unless it goes like, like they're shorter on the ends and then flare out on the tops. I usually cut it to where it just flares because I want it to more like wing all the way out. That's just how I like my eyes to look. So, <laughs> all right. Get comfortable, sweetheart. Get comfortable. Okay, I go in, do not judge my bottle, but I go in with the Kiss Strip Lash Adhesive, the clear with aloe. I'm telling you, see, it looks rough. Looks rough. I know, I need a new one. But I like it because it has like a brush to it. I just like the brush part of it. Okay, so the lash is completely empty. No, no lash glue. I can usually wear my lashes for, and I don't know how sanitary this is. I can wear them for about a week, but you can judge me if you want if that's unsanitary. So, I'm going to go in and just paint the lash. And I really focus like on the corners because I don't want that stuff to be lifted at all throughout the day. Which I carry my glue. If I'm wearing lashes, I'm carrying the glue with me. Like, that could probably be the only thing I'm carrying in my purse. But, well, that's a lie because I carry a whole makeup bag. <laughs> and I just let the glue get tacky. Because this glue will turn blue shortly before it's going to go clear. So when it's blue, that's when I get it tacky. Or that's when I want to get it tacky. When it's blue, that's when I um, go to place it on my eye. Which eye is this? Okay. Okay. Making sure I'm putting it on the right eye. The correct eye. Okay. Alright. So I just go in at like a downward angle. Then I get these. And I place, I literally, I'll place the band exactly where I want it to where it's not going to poke. This, I start from the outer and I'll go in and I just basically move my way across the eye, placing it right there on my lash line. Now for me, it doesn't, with these, since it's a very thin band, it doesn't affect me if it goes all the way to the inner corner. Especially if I don't have an eye look, I'm going to do from like corner to corner of a lash because I want it to, the lashes are going to be the focal part of the whole eye look anyways. So, but that's it. Don't play that. And I'll just go through until I know it's clear, or clear, until I know it's dry and just keep pushing because as I'm sitting here blinking, I could be moving it. So, but when I push down, I'm pushing down at an angle because I want them to flare up just because these aren't dramatic lashes. If they're dramatic, then I'm kind of going to bring them down because they're already going to be super, super curled. to the next lash like some people they can't take lashes all the way to the corner but for me it just it doesn't phase me I guess because I've, I've worn them for so long and it doesn't when I first started yeah they irritated me they did but I seriously <laughs> I just I guess I've worn them for so long it just doesn't bother me anymore And I'm not left-handed, so, um, don't judge me. So I literally, I usually have to wing it <laughs> on this eye. Because, I, like I said, I'm not left-handed. So it's not gonna, it's not always the easiest on this eye. Of course, today, it looked like a charm. Nothing happened.
Especially after I've worn them a few times, they are already shaped to my eyes. So it's easier to like lay on. But yeah, that's it. Like that went on easy because I'm sitting here complaining about how I'm not left handed. Now that that glue is dry on this side, I'm just going to, I'll go through. Now if I have a dramatic look already, I don't have to do this step because it's already done. Unless, sometimes the glue will dry like clear and I'll have to go in and just put this over my eye. She's literally right now, if you can see her nose. Alright. Just, it makes it more even. Instead of that rugged look, and that might have just been really uneven, but honestly, I don't care. <laughs> she is a goober. Like, she keeps us entertained, for sure. Like, she keeps me on her entertained, and it, oh, we love her to death. She's, she's a handful. Don't get us wrong. Look at my mirror. Got my mirror down. I and mean, they look good. I don't know. I hope this was somewhat helpful in some way. Um, oh, look. Okay guys, so I hope this was somewhat helpful in some way. Um, if not, I can always refilm it and do a more in-depth or answer questions that y'all have about them. Um, I kind of feel like I should just do like a live, like on Facebook or something or on Instagram and let y'all just ask me as I'm doing my lashes or doing my makeup or whatever. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. But I do have a video coming soon. I look up because there's all of my makeup is up there on my shelves. Sorry, honey. So, but I have a little bag of goodies that is very new, but they haven't came out yet in stores. They will be in stores Honestly, probably by the time this video goes up, <laughs> probably not. I plan on uploading this today, Thursday. I plan on doing it Friday. This, that little bag will be in stores on the 11th or 12th, depending on your store. It's stuff from BS. Yes, it's stuff worthy enough for a makeup video. <laughs> um, and that's all I'm going to say. But yeah. So thank you guys for watching and subscribe freely. Bye, guys. <laughs>